Well, my friends, welcome back. Yep. I figured I should get on here. Make a video. You're wondering, what video are you going to make? <laughs> well, I think I'll make a video of complying and not complying. Say they want to want to have a few more lockdowns somewhere out here in the east somewhere, blah, 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 whatever. Okay, that's fine. And they're going to come down with more lockdowns because, see, they've done it before, so they think they can just keep doing it. The first lockdowns were illegal as hell. Any lockdown's illegal. Martial law is illegal, okay? You see, we have Declaration of Independence. And in that Declaration of Independence, it, it talks about oppression and tyrants and tyranny and things like that, and how you have the right to throw the yokes of uh, tyranny and so on and so forth off, okay? And the Constitution talks about, you know, you get us, God, government, your Caesar, we get our power from God, and the government, well, they get their power from us and have to ask us our permission to do things. They don't have the right just to do things, they have to ask us, but they don't because they just claim the power they can do whatever they want okay you see when, whenever something's the opposite of what it should be and and it's lied about and made up and it's false and this and that look to the government you want to look to the truth you look to god and our founding forefathers said also that all men are created equal and and uh you know you have Bill of Rights, you know, be securing your personal paper things, you got the life, you know, well, goes back to the Declaration of Independence, well, and, and uh, the Constitution about life, liberty, pursuit of happiness, you know, you, you got freedoms, and you got freedom to travel, you got freedom to do all these things, okay? And we live in a constitutional republic, and that means you, every person has individual rights, not a democracy where it's mob rule and, and, and you live in a collective. No, 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 no. Further from the truth. Nothing could be further from the truth. See, folks, there's a common theme that runs through the Declaration of Independence, the Constitution, and the Bill of Rights. And that common theme is you're a free man and or woman that's right government's very limited in what they can and cannot do and they get their power derived from us you see they think they represent us and they can go do as they wish that is not true they still have to derive their power from us. And they don't ask. They just do. Well, that's in your best interest. And who are you to decide that? And there's a lot of things that they don't have the right to decide. You see, one of the biggest things I dislike, I can't stand it. I can't stand listening to it. Imbeciles say this. Imbeciles. So if you say... You're a law-abiding citizen. You're an imbecile. Okay? First of all, whose laws are, are you abiding to? God's or man's? And then on top of that, if you're abiding to man's, well, which laws are you abiding? You know, I mean, administrative and statute and, and court martial. I mean, there's all kinds of bullshit here and there. And then on top of that, the, 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 their laws violate your constitutional rights. You can't serve two masters. All right? So remember that. When you say law-abiding citizen, whose law, what law, there's a whole lot of involved in that stupid statement.
And I don't even understand that. I mean, if you really stop and think about it, it's such bullshit law-abiding citizen shit. Yeah, I get tired of that. You're tired of listening to it. And what I'm talking about is, you know, they're going to come out and some way, shape, or form, you know, they're going to have more lockdowns for something. They're already starting their crap again. Let's see how far they could push you. See, the thing of it is, is <coughs> like most things in life, you're sitting back trying to earn and make a living. You're busy with other things. And somebody is over here in the background, in the sidelines, whatever, creating problems for you. Creating a fight. So amongst all the crap you got going on in your life, then all of a sudden this sneaks in and now you have to make a decision. Am I going to be a law-abiding citizen follow their draconian bullshit? Or are you going to have to push yourself away from the table, stand up, because they brought the fight to you, okay? When you stop and think about it, the government always brings the fight to you. Their thing is, is the law, the law, fuck them and fuck their laws. They're a bunch of Satanists, devil-worshipping pieces of filth, okay? That's until they prove you otherwise. When they prove otherwise, that's another story. They violate their oath of office. They violate your rights constantly on a daily basis. Just by writing laws, they violate your rights. Now, do you want to sit here and say you're law-abiding? <laughs> you got no laws to abide by. Okay? You're Caesar. My attitude is they sign that little thing, they have to abide by it. They want more money, they sign for it, they better come up with the cash because, well, first of all, there's no cash. And second of all, you didn't authorize it. They did. But they want to say they authorized it in your name, which, if you asked, they, if they would ask you to said, hell no. Well, the system's going to crash. Most people say, let it crash. You see, they always try the fear thing with you, you see. That, that, that crap don't work. Okay? I don't care. I don't give one iota about their bullshit. None. I don't care about their wars. I don't care about their missiles and bombs. And I don't care about all that stuff. I'm going to threaten you with it all they like. I don't care. My reward is not here. Neither is yours. So what do you got to be scared of? Nothing. But they try to scare you and make you fearful of things. And when you're not scared and you're not fearful, all oh, they oh, scratch their head and go, oh, what, 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 what's happening? Well, what's happening is, is when you bring the fight to me, we will, we will end it. One way or another, it will be ended. And we don't care. Don't like to hear that. And it shouldn't have to ever come to that. But they keep pushing and pushing and pushing. Why? Because they're lawless. Okay, folks? They are lawless. Remember that. Remember, what master are you going to serve? Remember, you're Caesar. They derive their power from you. We derive our power from God. Everything comes from God. Everything. Remember that. I figured I'd get on here and spew a little bit because, I, you know, look. They're liars. Okay? They're deceitful. God doesn't lie. God's not deceitful. They are.
So you folks have a good one.